To get started with this super easy DIY towel hook installation, you're going to need a few items. You may want to pause the video and jot these things down or take a screenshot. Here I am just painting and prepping my board. Okay, so yesterday you saw me painting this board. Um, you guys, this is just the um, 5 8 by 7 inch baseboard trim that we used in the living room. It's a taller board. I know it looks really huge right here. But anyways, we um, just cut a piece and I painted it. And I am about to mount this on the wall for towel hooks because we don't really have a place to hang our towels yet. And so I don't like towel bars. I think those risk pulling out of the wall way too easy. So I've always been a fan of hooks and I got these off of Amazon, like a big package of them. I'm gonna be using them in other places throughout the house. But I'm gonna mount this board. I've already got my studs marked. Mike marked them for me. And so I can mount this board right about here and then I'm gonna be mounting my hooks directly to the board. But I'm gonna use a nail gun to attach the uh, board to the wall. So that's what I'm about to do for you. Really quickly before I attach those, I just wanna show you the before. So there's the wall, the shower, so that you kinda of get a better idea of what I'm doing here. Here I'm just placing my board on the wall and leveling it. I'm making sure that each end covers a stud. Studs are generally 16 inches apart. My board is 18 inches long. So I'm definitely hitting a stud on each end. Okay, so what I'm gonna do next is um, grab my spackling and cover these holes. They're not super deep, but I don't want holes like showing up on here. This final spackling works really well to cover up the holes. So that is what I'm gonna do. Get it open. I just dab a little bit on my finger, cover the holes. Some of them it's not covering because the nails didn't countersink all the way. But that's okay, because my paint will cover that. Okay, I'm just gonna let that dry for a few minutes and then I'm gonna take a damp paper towel and wipe it off. If you still have your paint handy, from painting your board earlier, go ahead and grab it because now's the time to dab over your nail holes. This paintbrush has been through the ringer, don't laugh. I decided to brush over my whole board to avoid seeing touch up spots. Okay, so funny story, um, after I painted that, I went ahead and took a shower and got ready, sort of. I was in the middle of getting ready and we had a little power outage throughout the whole neighborhood and surrounding areas. So. Because I have really great natural lighting here in my bathroom, I'm gonna just move forward with the video. Um, here are my hooks. I think I mentioned that I got these off of Amazon. I will link these for you in the description below. Um, they came with screws, which is great. Sometimes things like this don't, so it's perfect. All right, so I am just gonna hold my towels up and kind of see where I want them. I know I could measure, but I think it's better to just kind of hold the towels up, see where I want them. Another great thing about doing it this way is, you know, I hit the studs with my nail gun on this board. So the board is mounted to the studs, meaning that I don't have to use wall anchors or anything like that to attach these hooks. Um, that's always disastrous, especially when you're having to put four in there. But uh, now that I could mount these anywhere on here and not have to worry about, you know, if they're gonna stay on well or not. So um, I'm choosing to go about this distance. Again, I'm gonna hold my towels up and see. Yeah, so that'll be good. So I'm just gonna drop those, mark one and mount it. And then I'll measure the second one for sure. Just using my little Milwaukee drill here. Got 
got the first one attached, and now then I will move on to the second one. Okay, the moment of truth. Okay, so this is exactly what I wanted and I think it turned out really cute. It's a great addition to the bathroom, just its own little decorative piece. Um, you know, I had mentioned that you could apply these directly to the wall, but oh my wow, you guys, have you ever worked with wall anchors in sheetrock? or drywall, you know, sometimes that can be a total disaster. So mounting them on a wood board just helps to provide a great decorative piece and a very finished look. I hope you enjoyed this super simple tutorial hanging hooks for towels. Thanks so much for watching and don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, ring the notification bell for future fun tutorials. Be sure to click on this video right here to check out another tutorial.